YouTube, Derek Dimes, Ghost Picks ATS, your nation's number one trending sports handicappers right here on the East Coast, guys. First of all, if you're new, welcome to Dime Time. My name is Derek. Make sure you click the subscribe button, go up top, turn notifications on, as you're going to want to be notified every single time and give you any type of free content, leans, go live, anything like that, guys. Promos, um, win, lose, or draw, extremely transparent, guys. Um, you're going to know exactly what was on my card the day before, what I had, what we played, um, and everything like that. So, ridiculous um yesterday's free play was another effing loser I, i'm honestly about tired of it um everything went about as well as well as we it, we could have hoped for through the first six innings or so um three to one game four to one game um miami marlins were taking care of business um and then the, the relievers just imploded and it got absolutely rocked game goes over the total i believe the bottom of the eighth inning or so um so yeah tough 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 break there um, we did have Miami Marlins as a premium selection play on the run line there. They end up winning the game outright. Um, Gallon comes in and does an uh, excellent job uh, getting a little bit of revenge against the team that drafted him in the St. Louis Cardinals. So that was a nice premium selection play. So we did drop our free play. Um, on the premium side, we did sweep the board 3-0 and there. Um, we want to try to keep that momentum moving on into tomorrow. Tomorrow we do have a red alert. First ever Derek Dimes red alert. If you hop on my package, 99 bucks now until Sunday, the red alert will be included in that. If you don't, you can buy the red alert tomorrow, $49.99. Um, these are the big plays, highest level plays that we have here at Goose Picks ATS. We haven't had one in quite a while, and I have never had one ever. Um, just passed a one-year anniversary last week um, with my time here at Ghost Picks ATS. So do have a red alert, and we are going to have that dialed in and ready to go for you tomorrow. Um, but moving on to, to um, go over the rest of the card that we had yesterday, we had them um, on the run line. As I said, the Miami Marlins was a nice winner there. We also had the Giants on the run line against the Dodgers. Um, Dodgers had pretty much a bullpen day, um, and I thought it would be a chance um, for the Giants to score some runs late in the game, and they did exactly that, um, came back and pushed there um, and gave us a nice run line victory as well. So that was a nice winner there as well. Top-tier selection play was a nice dog for us there. We had the Chicago um, Cubs on the run line plus 130 there top tier selection play nice winner there um against the new york mets are just an, a, a terrible road team and their bullpen continues to struggle um day in and day out um and uh was a nice winner there for the chicago cubs on the run line was a top tier selection play of the day they went and took care of business for business for us there so three and no day on the premium side really got to dial in on these top or, or on these free plays um as we're having a nice little run here um on the premium side um, as I said, red alert tomorrow. Make sure you take advantage of it. Hop on board with that. Make sure you check out Benny. Benny, UFC King, guys. If you haven't jumped on his card, make sure you check him out. Check out the other handicappers on the Ghost Picks team. All their links are listed down below in the description as well. Jimmy had a nice bounce back day as well, I believe. So make sure you check out the other cappers, guys. Follow them. Get their um, Follow their pages. Get the information. Get the free plays. Take advantage of it, guys. Um, so we really got to buckle down on these free plays. I keep saying it and stressing it. Um, because I need it to happen, and it, it must happen, and I want it to happen, and it's going to happen. So we're going to get to a free play right here, right now. We're going to dial in and get you guys on a nice winner. We're going to go with the San Diego Padres here, going up against the Pittsburgh Pirates. I am rolling with San Diego in this one. They are a dog sitting at plus 103. They opened up. Um, it was minus 104 and minus 106 favoring the Pirates. Um, and so far, all the money is on the Pittsburgh Pirates here. Musgrove's on the mound. He's pitched against them before um, particularly well, and uh, Lauer's on the mound for the San Diego Padres. He did get shelled up his last outing, um, but and his away ERA, I think, is skewed here. Um, so it is a little high for the away games, but two of those games, uh, both were against the Rockies, and he struggles against the Rockies, and it's shown. He gave up five runs in two and two-thirds inning against the Rockies in his last game, and then the game before that in Colorado was well. He only went three innings. He gave up eight runs. Um, so you got 13 runs there on the road in just in two games alone where he didn't even make it three innings. Um, other than that, he's pitched very well on the road. Um, Pitch only gave up three to Arizona, two to Washington, um, and he gave up one to the Yankees. He did have a rough one there against San Francisco, but that was earlier on in the year, and they still ended up winning the game. Um, I think Lauer comes back here and pitches a very nice game um, and gets back on track here, as he is a solid, a solid pitcher, and he's had some quality starts here before that. He had back-to-back -back quality starts against the Nationals and the Philadelphia Phillies, both those games where he went at least six outings here. And you add to the fact that San Diego's have been swinging majorly hot bats here in the month of June. They have the second most run scored in the month of June, as you've seen coming off that um, series where they split with the Colorado Rockies. Um, they're playing really good baseball. Just took the series against the Brewers there and, and swept the Brewers outright, which I think shocked a lot of people. They're swinging the bats very well. I expect Lauer to come out and have a nice performance here. Um, 
Musgrove is just not a good pitcher, and their bullpen is atrocious. Um, some of the most blown saves in Major League Baseball have come from the Pittsburgh Pirates. Add to the fact that they are 26 in the league against left-handed pitchers. Um, I'm expecting the San Diego Padres to come out here and handle business. The Pittsburgh Pirates are 6-11 and 11 against left-handed pitchers this year. I'm expecting the Padres to come out here and continue to handle business and get us a nice winner here as an underdog play. Plus the 106, I believe it is. Let me make sure that it is right before we put it out. The wrong information. And plus 103. So plus 103, San Diego Padres on the money lines, the official free play of the day, guys. Dialed in and ready to go. 99 bucks, everything I have. If you hop on it, you get the red alert. Um, included in that package. Great value and great chance to hop on board with that. Check out UFC King Ben Dog. Check out Jimmy. Check out all the cappers here at Ghost Picks ATX, guys. Get winner, get lost. The young East Coast cappers, guys, here to try to grow your bankroll and get these free plays back on freaking track. Try my best not to curse. I'm a little riled up and, and not happy about these free plays. So bear with me, guys. We're looking to get back on board. Padres on the money lines, the official free, th free play of the day, guys. A little bit of taxi time. We'll be back in the office later today. Make sure our next video is in the office as well as we're trying to get some things handled um, before this rain um, comes down. It's been crazy here in Pennsylvania. But Derek, did it at the dimes. Ghost picks ATS, guys. Um, three Gs of ghosts is the motto. G times three is the creed. God bless. Good luck. Grind on.